So this morning guys, the bait shop ended up only having small trout and small medium trout and uh, gizzards. I was able to get them to pick me out some of the smaller gizzards, sort of the silver dollar three finger gizzards, which I think are great size for the stripers here. And so uh, right now we have one gizzard on a down line, one on a uh, weighted free line single split shot, and then two small trout on down lines. And so we're in the back of this creek early morning. Birds are flying around. As you can see, it's very foggy, um, but we're going to see if we can get bit here. All right, guys, a little bit better. Pack full of bait. Something's eyeballing that guy. We got a light wire hook on here. I think we got a number six Mutu on this. I told you I had to put the lighter hook on here so that we could get the bite. Make this guy look natural. There, let's measure him. See what he is. We got a big school fish coming through now. 27 and a quarter on the button. shot because this is some thick braid. Uh, he's a nice one. Nicer one. Hell they're all nice right? Yes sir. Follow our fish around the boat. Right there. See how he looks here. Ugh, look at that broom tail. Oh yeah. He is gonna be twenty-eight. Twenty-eight incher. There he goes. Good deal. Oh, well, finally, something made a gizzy. Finally, one ate a gizzy. Oh, we're gonna put another gizzy on now. Oh, small gizzy, that's all you need. That's a striper. That is a striped bass run right there. A lot more head shakes than kitty cat twist. Ugh. Man, these are these are so fat right now. Oh man, look at the graft down there. Got fish down there now, boys. About to come out. There we go out now and they are just pooping so, ooh.
There we go, baby. Another striper. Here's another nice one. Uh, they're down there on the bottom. I think we're done with this flat line, Gizzy. I think I'm just gonna put him on a down line. All right, good deal. Let's see if we are still recording everything. Yes, sir. And guys, it's like 10.30 and it's still... Ooh, there we go, we're on. That feels... Striper, oh yeah. Striper. That's all you need is just... Are these down lines. These are just, these fish are just coming through small groups we did see a really nice school earlier i got the whole creek to myself right now which is cool let him wear out a little bit feels a lot better than some of these other ones oh oh dude he might be the best one of the day oh, yes one of the best ones Oh man, yeah, he's the best one of the day. Right here, guys. Can't beat it. Lake Lanier, New Year's Eve, 2020. Been a crazy year, but just gotta enjoy it where you can. And this is a nice fish. He smacked that little small trout. He smacked it, and he is just about to burst with bait. These guys are just chewing. These guys are chewing. Circle hook did its job. Oh. Hey. We'll get a measurement on him real quick, but let me show him to you. <laughs> Can't beat that right there, guys. Cannot beat it. Let's get a measurement up here in the front. Let's see, what are we saying? Ooh, right there at 28 and a half 28 and a half damn thank you buddy happy new year get big get big can't beat it guys that's awesome can't beat it just out here enjoying mother nature catching nice striper 28 and a half inches full of bait just pack full Again, we're just doing it right here on this Mutu Light Circle Hook with 12 pound fluorocarbon, just like I showed you last night. Keeping the smaller hooks on since the bait's smaller, but we're just gonna keep hanging out here and dropping it down there. And drumming is, is critical. The way they are chewing. Oh, look at that group of fish down there. All right, see my side imaging off to the right? Those are stripers. That's probably about eight fish. I love it when I can just fish four down lines and be successful. Free lines are cool when they get whacked, but I'm noticing that we're really catching right where the bait stops. So these stripers are cruising through the bait, and then when the bait is gone, they find my bait. Ooh. There we go. Ah. Man. Oh yeah, little guy. But hey, big, small, we'll take them. They're all good fish. There we go. Oh my gosh, look at them down there, guys. They are thick. They are so thick. Get off of there. Oh my goodness. One of these downline rods has got to go down, but 
I really want to try uh, try my luck here at a spoonfish guys that would be fun oh my gosh too bad I can't <laughs> wildness guys it's crazy there we go they are all over we got to get a measurement on this guy guys but there's another one probably 24 I'm gonna say nope 26 26 nice quality fish back here thank you buddy happy new year that guy's the one I want right there Dropping it down to the bottom where the big boys lie. Ooh. They're on that one. Oh, that's on. That one's on. Oh, man. We are hooked up again. Trying to get them away from these other lines. Last thing I want is I'll be hung up again. Should be coming up. I thought it was all color. Oh yeah. Nice. Ooh. Another nice one. Dang guys. Wow. Look at that fish. These are all like 10 pounders. You know what? I thought we had caught the biggest, but nope, that's the biggest. There, I got it out, all right. That's great. Guys, I know I just got my head cam on, but look at that. We'll go measure him. This one is not gonna be 30. He is 29. There he is, guys. Thanks, buddy. Happy New Year. Thank you. Glad we got that hook out. Let me feel that. This is frayed because it was in his gut. Nope. This is fun. We are crushing them today. Another triz out. Out. Ooh. Oh, there we go. We're on. Another one. Cookie cutter. A little bit smaller. But daggum. Daggum. Yeah, he's not as big. He's more feisty. There you go, boys. And look at him pooping. Ooh, look at that poop. Ooh, look at that poop. Ugh. All right, buddy. Happy New Year. Something's down there again. You can see it, guys. Oh, that's a fish. There's a fish, that yellow mark. Right there, you can see it on that graph, too. Basically. We got you know down imaging side imaging traditional sonar and traditional sonar and uh i really like that one that old one but it's going out all that bait is just right back behind me so we're staying off of the bait just a smidge oh here we go yep that one there we go boys Hooked up again. Best wintertime striper bait. Rainbow trout. He's twisting the boat around. Which is fine. There we go. Right into that net, big boy. Another one, a little smaller. But hey, I'll take it. Happy New Year, buddy. Thanks for biting. 
Well, we got probably half a dozen more. That's it. And then we're out. There. It's crazy how much they love these trout. Just take a trout right off the bottom. Bam. All right, guys, it's not even 1130. We've probably caught over 15 striped bass right now. I think our two best are a little over 29 and a quarter and 28 and a half or so. So not too bad. Rainbow trout, all of them have been on rainbow trout, except for one. We got one on the downline gizzard chad. Uh, back in the uh, creek here, you know, we're literally just marked the bait and then dropping our downlines. You've seen it, it's been mayhem. Trout are more expensive, but really these guys uh, are the bait of choice. And we got a nice group of fish down below. So something's about to pop off here. Here we go. Ooh, ooh. That didn't take long. That didn't take long. Oh my goodness. That did not take long at all, guys. There we go, guys. Oh man, I just see a group of fish over there. Thanks, buddy. Happy New Year. Let's go get that trout. I nurse you back to health? Put another guy on there? I think so. Let's let you kind of get nursed to health and let's put another trout down. There we go. Got one. For socks. Oh yeah, he's a little guy. Here we go. Not a big one, but hey, they're all good ones. Happy New Year, little guy. Thanks for bite. All right, guys, we've moved to a new spot. We're gonna try a new spot. We got just a little bit of bait left here. We're gonna try to use that up. Let's see if we can get it. A couple more, a couple more stripers to. And this New Year's Eve trip off on the right note. It's been a great day. Uh oh. He is jamming. He is freaking out. Something's chasing him. Ooh. There we go. Got him. Seventy feet deep. 70 feet deep, right off the bottom. Right off the bottom. We just set our first two lines out here. And there's fish just cruising right there at the bottom. There you go, guys. Not bad. We're just dropping it down to the bottom, guys, and then just cranking up. And wow, there we go. We're on again. <laughs> Shouldn't have put that net up. Wow. There's a lot of fish down there. Pulling that drag, son. Oh. They are down at the bottom. Thick. 70 foot bottom, guys. Right there on the bottom. It's just two down lines down and wham. Oh, and these are these are good size. This is a good size fish. Look at this. Oh dude. Look at this. Look at that guy. Can't beat it, guys. New Year's Eve, baby. Wouldn't want to spend it any other way. Here we go. Ooh. 